Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to make this cool Harry Potter mode lamp powered by an Arduino. So this is a mode lamp which has a potentiometer and you can adjust the color of it according to your will. So let me power it up and it works on 5 voltage 2 ampere power. Okay. So now I have powered it on. Let me turn off the lights. So now it looks like this and you can change the color by twisting this potentiometer knob over here. Now I made it completely red. blue, purple, or pink, or any color you want. Now there's a switch at the back. If you press that switch, you can change the mode of the light. So now I have changed the mode of the LED, so they keep on changing the color on their own. So let's get started. So the things you're gonna need for this project are a USB cable. I have cut the end so that it will be easy to connect it to the Arduino. A mini USB cable to program the Arduino. A power adapter, a potentiometer, and three LEDs. Red, green, and blue. And two switches and an Arduino Nano and few white papers to make the lantern. So after you have wired up all the components, it should look something like this. Then you should upload the code, which is in the description. I have already uploaded the code, let's see how it works. Now it's in the automatic uh, color changing light uh, cycle. Now if I switch this then it will change uh, it to other mode. So now it's controlled by this potentiometer, it changes the color of the light. like this so now let's stick all of this in a box so now I have carefully placed all the components inside this box and here are the three LEDs and this is the potentiometer and this is the uh, mode switching switch so if you power it on and then spin it it should the light should turn on and start changing now to make the lamp just put your uh, you can just roll a paper and then keep it on top of it and then change start misting it and then you'll get your preferred color now let me turn the lights off now it really looks cool and if you keep on changing the color it goes to green and then goes to blue and then goes to pink and red first download the stencil from the description and then take an exacto knife and then start cutting it So after cutting it, it should look something like this. Then take a chart paper, preferably black color, and then put it on it. 
Then take a pencil and trace the outline onto the chart paper. So after tracing it, it should look something like this. Now take your exacto knife and then start cutting it again. So once you have cut out the stencil on the black chart paper, take a piece of white paper and then cut it uh, according to this triangle and then take some glue and stick it to it. Now start bending these edges. Now take a strip of paper and it has to be about the same length as this triangle side and then glue it to over here like this and then stick all these sides one by one. So after sticking all the three sides it should look something like this. Now take all your electronical components and then place all the three LEDs together onto the base of the triangle like this and then hot glue everything over here so once you have hot glued all the components inside it take the stencil and then trace it out on the chart paper again but this time do not cut the interiors so it should look something like this now bend this edges and stick it to the back side of this thing and cut two holes for the switch and the potentiometer to go inside it. So once you have stuck the back cover to it, it should look something like this. So here's the switch and this is the main switch and this is if you want to change the code for the Arduino and here's the potentiometer which changes the color. So that's it, our Harry Potter Arduino mode lamp is ready. Now plug it into a power source and it should work fine. Thank you for watching and please subscribe.